This is the office of the Lagos State Physical Planning Authority in the Ikeja area. It's behind these walls that the Osborne Foreshore Estate Phase 2 Residents Association and Lucky Gardens, an estate developer, are appearing before an eight-man appeal committee to look into the issues between both parties. While the session is not open to our cameras, the issues brought forward by the Residents Association include an alleged infraction and contravention of the state's planning laws, a flagrant and unchecked violation of officially approved building plans, and the Residents Association is concerned about the sewage system of Lecky Gardens' development. To these allegations, the estate development company at the session refutes insisting it has proper permits to carry out the construction in the estate. With several meetings and intervention over the last seven months failing to produce results, the chairman of the association is hopeful that this time the appeal committee will do right. Where you have a structure, the permissible approval for there is 28 units and you are building 84 units. We are calling on this appeal to come and stop it before an untold thing will happen and we we'll start blaming uh, uh, you know, the devil. Episode. We don't want the Gerard episode and, why, and we think that the time is now for something to be done. While the representative of Lecky Gardens left before our cameras could get to him, we reproduced an earlier interview with the top boss of the company where he states that high-density housing systems is the way to go. This time around, it's about people insisting what their definition of sustainable development is as the standard for sustainable development. Um, asking that you do not go past three floors if you go to London, we buy flats in 20-floor buildings. Why should development in Ikoi be a four-floor plan? Why does that make it sustainable? The Appeals Committee of the Lagos State Physical Planning Authority has promised to look promptly into the matter if a subsisting court case between both parties does not stand in its way. Bukola Joe Okitumbi, Channels Television News.